point, please. Play. If you love sport, you're going to love this guy. Djokovic is getting the job done here. The world number one secures his fourth Wimbledon final appearance. Will he defend his title? He's got the chance on Sunday. The way Roger Federer plays the game, I've never seen anybody like it. I've never seen anybody like it. Roger Federer will contest a tenth Wimbledon final. Novak Djokovic and Roger Federer, two titans of tennis who are both at the top of their game. Djokovic reaches his fourth Wimbledon final after beating Richard Gasquet in the semis. Although the Frenchman managed to keep toe-to-toe -to -toe with the world number one through most of the first set, an air of inevitability swept through centre court as the Serb moved through the gears to win in three sets and set up a second consecutive final with Federer. Defeats Gasquet. It was in straight sets, it was straightforward, and it secures his fourth Wimbledon final appearance. Uh, it's finals of, <coughs> of Wimbledon, and it's the most important match that uh, any player, tennis player, can have. And um, I'm going to get myself prepared for, for whatever is expecting me uh, on the court. Uh, it's not the first time that I'll experience this particular feeling and I'm going to try to use the, excuse me, the experience from, from the past in order to get myself in the right state of mind. Despite turning 34 next month, Federer is seemingly getting better with age. A blistering straight sets win over Andy Murray in his semi-final was wrapped up in just over two hours, amassing an impressive 20 aces in the process. It's away. Murray's dreams for this year are uh, over. Roger Federer will have a chance to do what no man has ever done as Wimbledon next win an eighth title. Great to play Novak uh, anywhere these days, you know, because he's, uh, he's a great player and he's uh, had uh, great success, unbelievable success actually over, throughout his career, but especially now the last few years, you know, he's been unbelievable dominant, especially in the hard courts and then he improved on the grass. On the clay, I mean, he's one of the best, if not the best. I'm just happy, for my, for my, personally, for myself to be back in the finals. Whoever that was going to be against, it's always a big occasion. But that it is Novak, the world number one, you know, it obviously adds something extra. I don't know if anyone's played as well and as 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 Roger, maybe at, at that age. Um, he's a he's a great sportsman. He's a great great tennis player, and um, it's tough. I don't know, it's tough to say if he's the, the best um, of all time. Serena's got a, a fair shout at saying the same thing um, as well right now. A 40th meeting between the world's top two, but just their third on grass, with one win each at the All England Club. The tie will rekindle memories of what was one of the great matches in last year's showpiece. Djokovic, successful in five sets, will be hoping to win this time with a lot less fuss. Treatment on his shoulder during his match against Gasquet on the court, not the ideal preparation before such a tie. Federer has barely broken sweat in each of his matches as the seven-time Swiss champion looks to make it a record eighth win at SW19.